Yeah, you know, it's a fantastic option for me to come to you know, such a club with a you know, massive history and a massive fan base. So, you know, to get the chance to come here and uh, play a few games will be, uh, you know, a really good step for me. You know all about <coughs> the stadium. Of course, you've scored yeah. at Villa Park for Chelsea in the Community Shield. Yeah, I did. So, you know, as a, hopefully it'll be a good, a good omen for me going forward. Yeah, what were your memories of that day? Uh, you know, I think we was losing in the game, so I think I just wanted to come, come on and do my part and hopefully I scored. So. Yeah, and impressions of the stadium and the general aura about the place? Yeah, lovely stadium. It was fantastic. And uh, whenever I, we've been here previously to play, the fans have been fantastic. I always created a good atmosphere. And uh, the pitch as well is uh, you know, fantastic. You've had a colourful football career so yeah. far, haven't you? You've made a few low moves. Do you think that'll help you in this environment, <coughs> in that you can go straight in and contribute? Yeah, definitely. I think you know, throughout my career, I've uh, I've been I managed to adjust, you know, quite quickly. Thankfully, I've been under throughout my career about 15 managers, I think. So, you know, <laughs> and uh, been on loan quite quite a lot. So, you know, hopefully, I can really get settled quite quick and you know, putting some good performances. You know, you've played in some big time occasions, none other than, than the Champions League final. You've got that in, a com in common with your manager here yeah. at, at Villa. Yeah. yeah, definitely. You know, I think we you know, touched on that briefly, you know, but like I say, it's a, it's a good thing to, to have and stuff, but I'm not too focused on it at the minute. You know, as, as much as I, as I respect what I've done, I, I want to kind of put that to one side and, you know, concentrate on you know, my football here and now and, you know, keep keep focused and keep progressing. Yeah. Has it made you look forward to this challenge even more, your conversation with Paul Lambert? Yeah, definitely. You know, I've been a chat with the, with the managers, you know, really, I'm really looking forward to, uh, you know, getting on the pitch. Lots of talented young players here, aren't yeah. there? Yeah, there is, definitely. You know, I think that's one thing that I noticed, uh, you know, when we'd play, and I'd watch it from, from afar that, you know the players are really they really express themselves, and there's a lot of uh, you know young talented players here. Yeah, and moving forward, there are some some huge games to come between now and the end of the season. There are, you know, but that's that's what they're the games you, you want as a footballer. They're the games you uh, you play for. Ashley Cole, one of the finest left backs in recent mm -hmm. years in world football. Mm -hmm. How much have you learned from him going forward in your career now, and how can you use that? Yeah, you know, he's been a, you know, a constant uh, guidance for me throughout the years and stuff. So, you know, I really, really benefited with uh, having that, you know, that, that close relationship with him. And, uh, you know, I can start, hopefully I can start putting into, uh, you know, put my own stamp on things. Now. Villa and Chelsea have something else in, in common, of course, having won the biggest prize in European football. Yeah, it was called the European yeah. Cup in those days, what yeah. one Villa did, but a huge history, mm -hmm. a huge tradition. Is that something that appeals to you? To, to yeah, play definitely. Play definitely. You know, it's, a, it's a club with you know, massive history, you know, a fantastic fan base. And, you know, but not only that, it's a real uh, traditional you know, kind of English club as well, where it's uh, quite a family club as well. You get the feeling that you know, everyone is really nice and people know each other and stuff, so it so it's never lost that, that side of it either.